adventure lovers. Today I will be doing part two of my road trip to Frederick, Maryland series, and the focus is on an Afghani restaurant called Layla's Kitchen in Hagerstown, Maryland. On my way to Frederick, I stopped at a rest area on Interstate 70 and thought to myself, I still have plenty of time before the rehearsal. So I look at my trusty smartphone and go to the Urban Spoon app and find any restaurant that are in Hagerstown, Maryland, which is on the way. I chose Hagerstown because it's right on Interstate 70, and I've never eaten at a non-chain restaurant in that town. Hey, it crosses another thing off my list. Looking at Urban Spoon, I decided to choose Layla's Kitchen because it was ranked high on the list, and I was in the mood for some Afghani food. When I went inside, it turns out to be a no-frills kind of place. The tables and chairs are simple, and the only fancy part of the restaurant is the few pictures they have and their green wall. I've noticed a pattern in Middle Eastern restaurants in that they don't make those places fancy or trendy for the most part. It shows that the food is the main focus. What was also interesting is that they didn't give you a menu. All their food and drinks is on a chalkboard, and you have to order at the counter. Fortunately, the menu on the chalkboard isn't huge because I can be indecisive when I see a huge menu. I initially ordered a chalpi kebab, but they ran out of the ground beef for it, so I ended up getting the sautéed lamb instead. It came with non bread and a mix of yellow and white basmati rice. From the looks of it, it's a fairly simple dish. The sautéed lamb had tomatoes, onions, and a red sauce, which I should have asked what it was. The lamb was tender and blended well with the other ingredients. My favorite aspect of the dish is that I could put the rice and lamb on the non bread and then eat it. Makes this dish fairly fun and entertaining. Overall, I would recommend this place if you guys happen to pass Hagerstown on Interstate 70. Layla and her husband are very welcoming and make you feel like you're home. You get a home-cooked meal, prices are reasonable, and it's a good change of pace from fast food places. Thanks for watching this blog, and happy eating.